Hi everyone, Microsoft is retiring the legacy command console on Windows 11 and feature releases. The company quietly updated its documentation page in December 2023, noting that the legacy console mode has been deprecated, meaning it'll no longer receive updates. In addition, the documentation points out that the console will no longer come as a system component on Windows 11. However, it will be available as a feature on demand that anyone can install from the optional features settings page or run the DISM, add capability command. Although the command console is often associated with command prompt, it's actually a tool to access features such as PowerShell and command prompt. Since Windows 10, the system has included three consoles, the Windows Terminal, Windows Console, and the Legacy Console mode. The Windows Terminal is the newest default experience to access Command Prompt, PowerShell, and Linux through WSL. The Windows Console is the newer experience that replaces the original console, and the Legacy Console mode brings a compatibility layer to run older command line tools that do not work correctly in the newer version of the console or the terminal. In other words, Microsoft is only retiring the Legacy component. You will still be able to access the Windows Console. However, it's recommended to use the Windows Terminal, which should already be the default experience on Windows 11. Microsoft isn't detailing the reasons for the decision, but it's likely because telemetry may now indicate that not many users are reverting to the legacy mode to use command line tools. If you're watching my video for the first time, please make sure to grab the subscribe button to get the thumbs up and turn on your notifications, so you never miss an update. See you in the next video. I'm <laughs> sorry.